You've probably heard the term mental health, but do you really know what it is? It isn't always easy to understand, and it can be even harder to talk about. Mental health is how you think and feel about yourself and the world around you. These thoughts and feelings can be positive, neutral, or negative. When negative or challenging thoughts and feelings start piling up, it can affect your thoughts, mood, and behavior. Then you know your mental health needs some attention. Just like you get crutches when you break your leg, sometimes your brain needs extra support. It's just as important as any other part of your body. Are you nervous about something happening in the world? Upset your friends aren't hanging out with you? Or maybe you just suddenly feel sad, angry, scared, or worried. Maybe you're acting out or having difficulty concentrating. Some people get headaches, stomach aches, or get super tired when their mental health is bad. Others feel like hurting themselves, drinking, or taking drugs. It can be confusing and scary, but it's okay to not be okay and to ask for help when you don't feel like yourself. You're never alone. There are lots of people in your circle who care about you, at home, at school, and in your community. At home, talk to your parents, grandparents, siblings, or any family member you trust. At school, talk to your favorite teacher or principal, or any trusted adult. Every school has counselors who are experts in navigating feelings and helping students out. They'd be happy to talk to you. In your community, many organizations and community members can help, including doctors, nurses, counselors, and friends. Many are trained to help when kids and teens need it, either in person, by video chat, phone, or text. There is lots of support out there. You just need to reach out at home, at school, or in your community. Remember, you're part of the circle too. Believe your friends if they share their difficulties with you. It's not always easy to do. Assure them that their feelings are normal and that there is help. Trust is important because it makes them feel safe to talk and open up. Listen, support, and empathize without judging so your friends feel heard and accepted. If additional assistance or support is needed, you can help each other connect with resources and counseling at school and in your community. You don't have to do it all by yourself. Let's take care of ourselves and one another.